welcome to Day Michelle from 97Z OK. On this week's episode of Please Teach Me, I'm gonna learn how to paint my nails, finally, at Rockton Sanctuary Spa. Michelle, I'm hanging out with Carla today at Rockton Sanctuary Spa. Uh, you have hello. the biggest job of the year. No, not really. It's my New Year's resolution to learn how to paint my own nails. Wonderful. I am 30. <laughs> the first thing I would do is put on a cuticle conditioner. Okay. It just softens everything up. The best time to really do this is right after you get out of the shower. You okay. step one done. Yeah, I could do I, that part. <laughs> more rounded or more squared? Um, like middle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is the most popular. Squoval is what we call it. Squoval? How do you spell that? S Q O V O. Oh, I like it. <laughs> and this is the love part of the manicure that we usually don't do for ourselves at home. Put on a nice moisturizer. Okay. So. This is the hardest part. This is the hardest part. And this will be the most important part right before we start polishing. Okay. Clean off your nail bed. Clean off your nails. Acetone, polish remover. Even if there's nothing on your nails. Even if there's nothing on them, clean them off. The drier they are, the better the product will stay no matter what you're putting on. All right, which hand are you gonna polish? I'm getting so nervous. I'm gonna have to try with to do the left because there's no way I'm doing my right hand. And the key to a good polish application for you is to not have too much on your brush. Okay. It's like you do this for a living yeah, or something. Like I've done this a few times. <laughs> And if you noticed, I didn't use a base coat. That's because of this product. Okay. It's two coats of color, and a specific top coat goes okay. with it. So whatever nail polish you're using probably has rules regarding yes. that stuff, so yep. pay attention. Go. Okay, so check out this beautiful first hand that Carla did. It is, in fact, beautiful. Now we move on. <laughs> Just so scary. You Am can, I supposed to start with You can do finger? whatever finger you want to start with. Well, don't tell me that. I'll start, <laughs> I'll start in the middle. It doesn't okay. matter. And I'd lay your hand down okay. and probably turn it this way towards this you. Way. Okay. So that ball of polish is down and go back. There you go. I feel like a four year old. See, then this is where I get nervous because now I don't know how to continue. If you start kind of back a little and uh -huh. then go forward, that'll fill that gap where you're afraid to get too close. Uh -huh. And that's enough paint for one finger? Yes. Okay, yeah. I think that is an yeah. issue that I also have. Yeah, you I don't know if I even... I'm like yeah, so nervous go. I can't even talk. That's all right. We can here dip in and get some more. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. So when I used to make my mom paint my nails, I would yell at her when she didn't get to the end. <laughs> Which is so rude. This is why I'm trying to tackle my New Year's resolution in January so that I have 11 more months of practice. <laughs> That's right. Well, it still looks like a third grader did that, so. <laughs> Wanna do the second coat? Not really. <laughs> do you want you me to do, do the it? second okay. coat? <laughs> There you go. It. And I attempted to paint this one, but Carla, look, you made them match. <laughs> look how beautiful. Oh, I know this will be uh, just one video, but it will be lots of attempts uh, for me. But a huge <laughs> thank you to Carla for teaching me as much as she could on how to paint my own nails. If you want to teach me how to do something, let me know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, ZOKTV. Thank you. You're very welcome. <laughs>